Oh boy. So, yes, 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 yes. I don't believe in God. Oh, scary, sketchy. Yeah, okay, whatever. Uh, like, whatever. Uh, you don't believe in Santa Claus. Uh, uh, <laughs> anyway, so I'm, I'm reading the Bible. Because most people are Christians, and if you could, like, point out the hypocrisy, it gets a laugh, you know? It, it gets them to smile a lot of times. If they don't smile, they're not your audience. I mean, even, even Stephen Colbert, as Catholic as he is, has absolutely eviscerated religion and the, uh, the hypocrisy of Christians. And I think that's the funniest thing about Stephen Colbert. I'm sure J uh, Gaffigan has also, and he's a Christian. But, uh, like, if you want evidence that this Jesus character even as an atheist, as a trope, was funny. You have to read a book called uh, Matthew 23. Uh, specifically, Matthew 23, 3, 4. Because the whole diatribe of Matthew 23 is how religious people are a bunch of fucking hypocrites. And in, in taken in the right light, it's comedy gold. Because if you imagine him as like, me or Ricky Gervais or like Bill Maher or yeah Lewis Black uh, or you know George Carlin you imagine him as like a, a, an atheist comic or even like Sam Harris who's not a comic but is funnier than shit um, read the book of Ma uh, Matthew 23 it's not that long it's like a couple pages might not even be two pages but the the the, the Butter on the toast is Matthew 3, 4, where he's just, oh boy, he's, he's like, what he said was, religious people are fucking crazy, do what they ask you to do, but don't follow their example, follow the scripture, which is what most Christians don't do. How many forgiving Christians have you met compared to forgiving atheists? Have you even met an atheist? How about a kind atheist or a kind Christian? How often do you meet somebody that is super duper religious and also kind? How often do you meet somebody that's uh, not religious that isn't kind? Usually like people that are lax on their religion or people that are better behaved like Buddhists. But you don't meet a lot of angry Buddhists really. And you probably don't meet a lot of like I've met more angry agnostics than I've met angry atheists. And I've met angry atheists, too, and a lot of atheists are angry. Justifiably so. But they're not mean, you know what I mean? Like, uh, you could be angry and nice at the same time. Fuck misogyny! There's something to get angry about, but I'm not being mean now.